Liam, back to winning ways again. Much very pleased with the, with the result and a good, good bounce back from last Friday. Yeah, it's a great result. Obviously, we had to win from that end of it. Um, I thought the performance was very good as well. We kept the ball really well. Probably yeah, just in the final tour, we need to tighten it up a little bit and get a better award for all the play that we have. But after last week, it's just hugely disappointing for everybody. Um, it just keeps us in the mix and we just have to see where we go. A couple of results went their way tonight as well. I know Stiger won with Ryder beaten, so edged us up for the table a bit. I look at you, does, yeah. But listen, there'll be plenty of points dropped in one before we down the end of the season. Like We all have to play each other you know, at least once, and it'll be a tricky, there's quite a few tricky ties to go, so we just need to keep your head down. We'll Stiger next Friday now, we'll draw and apply that as best we can, so you can get something out of that game. Great away um, record this season. Obviously, a tough pitch here tonight, it's not ideal, but the guys still pass it around and obviously stuck to the game plan. Yeah, I thought they did great tonight. Uh, it, the pitch, if this is water, the plays reasonably well. When it's not water, it gets quite tacky and whatever but uh, I thought they did particularly well they passed it well they kept the shape better um, I, I felt we were relatively comfortable although at one you always fear a knock on or a flick on somewhere but other than that I mean you know it's a win we just push on you know, we regroup again tomorrow off Wednesday a little bit Thursday and um, we'll see where we go so on Friday that one goal he scores tonight, Sean O'Connor. He's got a few crackers here last season against Dundalk. He seems to like to, to surf some pen against Dundalk. Yeah, we're trying to encourage the wide players, you know, to get in these positions to, to get shots, you know, the kind of to get finishes sort of thing. There's still a bit of work obviously to be done on it, but uh, I'm delighted for him. Great strike, and uh, I've no doubt he'll score a few between now and the end of the season. Obviously, not a huge game. Uh, Sligo Rovers at home on, on, on Friday, so I'm just looking to get three points. But uh, treatment tables are busy this, this, these days. A couple of yeah, yeah, we've, maybe. Got, we've got quite a few that are started. John Russell, we'll have to wait and see how he goes this week. And your Dean Kelly's and your Stephen O'Flynn. Rossler's obviously gone for the season. We had a couple of suspended tonight with Kenny Brown and Darren Mean, and you know, so it's been a little bit. Well, in fairness, we brought in one or two of the younger kids. Brian Coombs came in last week down in Cork. What a place to make a debut from the first team perspective. I thought he was brilliant. He came along tonight, he's done great. Um, delighted for him, he's, he's done particularly well. Um, but when you look at Jay Carroll, Christy Forrester, there's a, a sprinkle of young fellas here that uh, have done really, really well. So, that said, next Friday, if we can get one or two back off the treatment table, it will help. But we'll be looking to try and get the best result we can out of that toy. Thanks, Dominic.